March is National Craft Month, and recently we've seen a few woodworkers carving out some stunning items. Teresa Strasser is here to share three carpenters inspiring folks with their creativity. Teresa. Thank you. These carpenters are churning out cool carved works of art. Coming in at number one, Tom Rhodes, AKA the wood carver of Warsaw, Virginia. I like to make Christmas presents and birthday presents for people because it beats giving them a toaster. The 80 year old has carved and customized around 1,000 golf balls. I can't play golf, so I just destroy the balls. You never run out of materials or ideas for carving. He also carves and paints trees in what he calls the enchanted forest. I can't sing, teach, preach, nothing else. That's the only thing I can do, man. He's made around 80 wooden characters, each one taking about five hours. Spider-Man! Spider and folks in his community love spotting his work. I'm pleased that other people can find some pleasure in my efforts. I personally like all of them. And so do we. At number two, Milwaukee, Wisconsin's Tonda Thompson. Working in this wood shop was kind of like therapeutic. And I went and bought some two by four lumber and made a coffee table. She's a self-taught carpenter who makes functional furniture with her business called She Slangs Wood. Just take it whenever you want to just come out and have fun. Turn it to a bench here, you know? Her business is thriving on her Facebook page where you can request her work. And she recently got national attention when she was featured on the Kelly Clarkson show. What's up, Kelly? How you doing? You know, like everyone says, woodworking is the fast track to fame. And third on our cool carpenters list, Bro Bridge, Louisiana's Eric Cuvia is giving new life to fallen cypress trees. Mother Nature painted the picture. These are dinosaurs that still have meat left on the bones. The 67-year-old sources the wood from his 2,000-acre property. Dig them, roll them, chain them, pull them out, load them, bring them here, mill them. It's a process. And his commissioned work that mostly comes from former Louisiana residents ranges from 3000 to 20000 bucks. And they want a piece of Louisiana. They want a piece of their heritage. You can check out his work at liveedgeworks.com. And those were three cool carpenters who are being celebrated for their talent. 